So so there's a movie on Netflix called Don't Look Up. Now, I'm not the person that right, really want to peddle conspiracy theories or say the government's trying to tell us something because I can't stand the people that do that. I'm not one of those people, but wait. Don't look up sound too damn real, first of all. Like, it sounds way too real, way too much going. If y'all want to tell us a comet is coming to hit Earth right now, just tell me right. Tell me to my face. I got some things I want to do. I got some celebrities I want to shoot my shot at. I got some threes and foes I'm trying to take to the hotel room in public with the windows open right now. I got some phone bills that I cannot pay. I got some people I owe money that I can tell them, come get it in blood. If this is what's going on, don't look up. When I grew up, we had a movie called Deep Impact, right? And then we had a movie where Bruce Willis rode an asteroid that was coming to Earth and he blew that up. And it gave us one of the greatest soundtracks in the history of music. That was end of the world movies for us. It was far-fetched. Like, nobody finna go ride no damn asteroid like a cowboy. That's not gonna happen. 2021, y'all generation, y'all make things way too real. Way, way damn too real. Um, I don't know if this was a documentary. I don't know if this was a glimpse into like the middle of next year. I don't know what this was, but what this was, I shouldn't have watched it at 1 a.m. Gone off two sneaker bars and a sweet tea from Popeye's because the nightmares that that gave me, I wouldn't wish on nobody. Don't look up. It got everybody. It got Leonardo DiCaprio who's ascended into his Robert De Niro phase of his life. Leonardo DiCaprio. Is, is, is going to be a mob member in a movie real soon. Watch what I tell you. It, it, it had um the girl from the Hunger Games that looked like she fresh out the Hunger Games. Still fine. It had Ariana Grande. She said a bad word in it. I ain't even know she cursed. It had Hellboy as a military captain. I call him Hellboy because he looked like Hellboy with the evil without the makeup on. The president in this movie was a complete whore, which confused me. Jonah Hill looked like he's still sniffing coke from the Wolf of Wall Street, and his 5 o'clock shadow looks amazing. It had a lot of other famous people in it. Don't look up got me scared. Don't look up got me paranoid. Don't. There's a scene in the movie, right? And I'm not trying to get spoilers away. But there's a scene in the movie scene when the calamity starts to happen. Looks way too scary. Like there's a scene in that movie that will make you go find your nearest church and say, Lord, please forgive me for my sins. Wash me in your blood and save my soul right now. Because I'm not ready to die with none of these people on earth. I'm, I'm not ready to go out with them. If, if this is what's going to the government, if this is what's going to happen to tell Mark Zuckerberg, Zuckerberg, please don't suppress this video. I'm, I'm just talking to you. If you know something, we'll know. If this if this is why we need to get into the metaverse, tell me now. Give me my avatar. I want to look six foot four, 270 pounds with abs. Give me, give me my avatar body right now. Damn it. Don't look up. Got me shook in a way I shouldn't be shook like that. Leonardo DiCaprio has gained some weight too. It looked like he don't eat, he don't eat a couple Subway bologna rounds with extra provolone cheese. But what I'm saying is, don't look up. Just got me shook.